the short story Board of the Burn, written by Brian Fred Warren McGregor on Saturday the 13th and Sunday the 14th of May 2023. About years ago, there was two kids, new roughly called Mitch and Steve Roy, that would be up at a bridge, to throw stones at tin cans. There was sometimes four down on high water from the new cannon plant that did the can juices just after school on the way home. Which didn't do much harm as such, really. I mean, they were just kids having a carry on. Now, these two kids did this year in and year out. All their school and years. Oh, whilst at least they're back in school back then. As many kids as they throw stones at. Guys, merely mind to practice for that. Fair grind shows where they could win prizes at the various shies. Like coconut shies and tin can shies. Which was a good laugh. So these two childhood friends would do this each school night on the way home. Which is why they would meet there. Exactly. However, that little burn, a small brook, it could be said, often flooded, and large amounts of cans would come down as mentioned, which meant in reality, it was a practice as such, it could be said. Now, on the last day of school, at least primary, back then, they met up at that bridge, one, one, really last. Time. So the pair joked and laughed about all the years that they met at the bridge, that very bridge from primary on the way home. So we'll met just Steve at that bridge. Found it flooded once again after a heavy collection of showers. That very morning and somewhat after noon just before they arrived there. So now they, uh, the pair started throwing little stones at the passing cans as they passed and they even came out. The other side in somewhat raging stream now. The Mitch's table went to different upper schools. After that, although later confessed, they were a bit fed up as Pelting those cans, you know. However, a few years later, they both, they had got jobs at the very cannery. And soon after then, they were going home together as they lived near to each other. And would be returning in a similar direction, or route anyway. And so Steve would end up getting a lift back with Mitch over that same bridge they they used to bury all the kids when they were much younger. This pair would travel as workmates and somewhere still friends, I guess, and chat all the way homewards after work in the early evening. Strange enough, it seemed to roughly like when they were kids too. So one particularly afternoon. The pair got to talk about the last day of school and when they met there. So just as Mitch approached Steve's home, they are again finished their conversation and Mitch 
sons to steal and seize them. Remember when we were throwing stones at cans in the barn from the branch over the years? And also that last of last, the oldies, way back when. At that point, Steele replies, Yes, Mitch. Why? Mitch said, Well, when you were throwing stones at them, I missed. None of them. Did you ever think that was unfair? You know my pictures. Pretty terrible, although. Oh, it proved when you gave me those old weightlifting gloves of yours. Which somewhat helped my aim. Well, in truth, it beat a bit progressively. So that boy Steve replies, Aye. Ah, mm. Because, well, it's just that. This is the way life is. And you can't be good at everything. Well, I wanted you to win sometimes. A whole perfect ish pitch at the burden and well it came. Too strong. Every time which ultimately proved useful. And now the works darts team. I know it's true, it's true. So in the natural and naturally good, good skills. We should be encouraged, bear the body even of self and others with similar potential. And well, we both need it. Into the work starts, for myself the captain of it. As you know, bitch. I am no steel. I've gotten better with you as the captain of the work staff team. Well, aye, Mitch, one way of looking at it is, I suppose, is that smart people become like smart people, and they do this by learning the ways of who, like themselves, did things. They liked and once where it could be said smart men smarter themselves in a similar manner. So, you know, things not so good can be developed into good things. And with each other, we developed our throwing. It's something productive, low mind, the coconuts and goldfish at the fairgrounds. But sort of nice at which point they said they both laughed loudly. Oh, shake their legs. As you probably know, someone once said to me, you see, everything natural has purpose, and so make it purposeful as best can naturally. Well, Steel nods and your silence. Opens the car door and is about to step out when Mitch says, You know, Steel, you've been playing darts a while, and you've been progressing towards my own skill level. It's just I was thinking of those cans back then. I ah, see. You're doing the same with the darts. And well, I was thinking I was. You're an edge. And well, you get more prizes like what we used to. A way back way. So, he then hands the his old darts cuffs. From the works darts. And a small smile adds, Though I'm retired, I'm sensing you on me. No, I'd still, it's like, it's like we used to, you know, help each other freely for free when best opportune. I then adds, well, Mitch, as a new head of the team, you'll be back to winning. Go fishing, coconuts in. Although aim for something bigger. Even if it means avoiding them all together. For laughing and pulling his own passenger. Car door shut from the inside. Most adding, see Steve. Who himself adds, I know it will work, but I'll see you. Aye, just before it shuts. Now, well, Steve all smelled a little with his new sports gloves, and he thought for a better future 
after he has it. It's important to always become as much as a friend as find someone trustworthy the same. Who has no direct interest or motivation for or by any pure gain as such. With nothing or little else from yourself. So now as Mitch's car pulls away, Steve walks into his home. And well, you know, Steve was played tarts and proofed, and just like the cans in the barn, he progressed. But this game, he made a nice living. Albeit stemming from hitting those very cans way back way in that barn. He never got fed up. But this newer game. It started as and was named as the Board. Board of the Barn. The End and a Brian Fred Worm McGregor production on Saturday the 13th and Sunday the 14th of May 2023.